Dow down over 100 points right now, hovering around 15,000. That means we need to try especially hard to find some growth. And guess where we're going? We're going to Europe. Time for a little insight and action. All right, here's why we are focused on Europe, at least for this particular moment. A possible European comeback. I know it sounds crazy, but look at the data. All right, we're talking about industrial output. This came out earlier this morning. And look what had been the trend several months back in the fall and early winter. And now look what's happening into the spring. Three consecutive months of rising industrial output. Maybe, maybe there is a European comeback, a little bit of a turnaround. So what we decided to do is actually look at European companies, European industrials, which are growing. I know, what a concept. We found them. As a matter of fact, we found about a dozen. I'm going to show you a couple now, and then I'm going to post the whole list on Twitter, at AG Insight. CGG, you've probably not heard of this one, Seismic Imaging, but it's growing sales at 24%. The Lind Group, Chemicals out of Germany, 12%. Masca, uh, MCO, Engineering out of the UK, 48%. Starts to get your attention, right? Here are a couple more. Again, I'm going to post the whole list on Twitter, at AJ Insight. Rolls-Royce, Engines up 24%. Technip, Construction, Zodiac Aerospace out of France, up 15%. Here is why you really want to pay attention. These guys are in the race. So for all the concern about what's happening in Europe, look, the European growers, this group of industrials that are growing, up 10.5% this year, barely, barely below the S&P 500, which is up about 14%, and well ahead of uh, the Euro 50. So there is growth in Europe. You just have to know where to look, and you can find some of the names at AJ Insight on Twitter. Trip. All right, we'll be checking it out. AJ, thanks.